हेलो गाइस वेलकम एंड वेलकम बैक टू माय चैनल जेबीआर ऑनलाइन क्लासेस लाइक शेयर एंड सब्सक्राइब माय चैनल सो हेलो एवरीवन नाउ इन दिस वीडियो आई एम गोइंग टू स्टार्ट एक्सरसाइज 3.4 फ्रॉम सम नंबर 7 दिस इज द सेकंड पार्ट फ्रॉम दिस एक्सरसाइज फॉर द प्रीवियस वन प्लीज चेक द डिस्क्रिप्शन बॉक्स द लिंक विल बी देयर सो हियर इन सम नंबर 7 फाइंड द स्मॉलेस्ट फोर डिजिट नंबर विच इज अ परफेक्ट स्क्वायर सो फर्स्ट यू हैव टू नो विच इज द स्मॉलेस्ट फोर डिजिट नंबर एंड दैट इज वन थाउजेंड ओके सो नाउ यू हैव टू फाइंड आउट द स्क्वायर रूट ऑफ दिस वन सो फर्स्ट यू हैव टू मेक अ पेयर फ्रॉम लेफ्ट टू राइट द नेक्स्ट वन हियर थ्री थ्री जो नाइन ओके सो इट्स वन डबल जीरो नाउ डबल ऑफ थ्री दैट इज सिक्स देन वन हियर ऑल्सो वन सो इट विल बी हियर सिक्सटी नाइन and that equal to 39 okay so as here 31 and here remainder is 39 that means here the next the next square number okay which is greater than 1000 the next square number which is greater than 1000 that is definitely 31 plus 2 whole square that means here 32 whole square and 32 whole square means 1024 so 1024 is the smallest four digit perfect square number that is your answer next one sum number 8 find the greatest number of six digit so as here greatest number of six digit that means 1 2 3 4 5 6 okay so now here make a pair you have to find out the square root of this one so as here 99 okay so here 99 za 81 clear so here 8 1 now here 9 9 next here double of 9 it's 18 now here 9 here also 9 that will be here 1701 okay and it's 198 now again 9 9 now write down the double of 99 that is 198 so here again 9 this 1 9 So it's one seven seven. Sorry, one seven nine zero one. Okay, one seven nine zero one. So here one nine nine eight. Now as here nine 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 nine. This is the last six digit number, and here you have to find out the perfect square of six digit number which must be less than that number. Okay, must be less than that one. so that means your answer will be in that case 99999 and then subtract 1998 from that one so it's 100899 okay so this is the six digit greatest perfect square number okay so that means for the smallest number you have to add one with the quotient and then find out the square of that number and to find out the greatest number you have to just subtract the remainder from the greatest number is it clear okay now next sum number 9 in sum number 9 here in a right angle triangle abc so here abc is a right angle triangle and here angle b equal to 90 degree if ab equal to 14 cm bc equal to 48 cm then find ac so you know the pythagoras theorem that is ac square that means hypotenuse square equal to perpendicular square plus bc square so here ac equal to root over of ab square ab square means 14 square and bc means here 48 square okay so 14 square plus 48 square it becomes 2500 so ac equal to 2500 under root that means here 50 cm that is the first answer now in the next case in the next case here ac equal to for number 2 ac equal to 37 bc equal to here 35 now you have to find out ab so as here again pythagoras theorem so ab square definitely it will be here ac square minus bc square okay ab square equal to in that case ac square minus bc square that means here 37 square minus 35 square okay and that one equal to 144 so ab square equal to 144 ab equal to root over 144 that means 
centimeter that is your answer next sum number 11 a gardener has 1400 plants okay 1400 plants he wants to plant this in such a way that the number of rows and the number of columns remain same so suppose here number of rows that equal to x okay and definitely number of column that equal to again x now total number of plants definitely it will be x into x so as here x into x that one will be 1 4 double 0 okay so as here x square equal to 1 4 double 0 okay so now you have to find out the square root of this one so here 3 3 is a 9 then that one equal to 5 double 0 double of here 6 7 here also 7 so that equal to 4 6 9 okay so here 31 that means if okay so here find the minimum number of plants he need more for this he need more for this that means here the next perfect square number that equal to 37 plus 1 that equal to 38 square okay the next perfect square number greater than 1400 that is 38 square and it's 1444 4, 4. that means the gardener needs 144 minus 1400 that equal to 44 more plants okay the gardener needs 44 more plants next number 12 in number 12 there are thousand children in a school for a pt drill they have to stand in such a way that the number of rows is equal to number of columns how many children would be left out in this arrangement so as the previous one he need more plants but in that case in that case how many children would be left out okay so left out means here the remainder will be your answer okay here the remainder will be your answer so as here thousand so if you want to make it a perfect square so you have to find out the square of this one so here three three nine it's double zero then six one here also one and that is here 39 okay so that means here 39 39 is the remainder and your answer will be also 39 39 children will be left out in this arrangement because if you subtract 39 from this one then you will get what 961 okay and 961 is the square of 31 so that means here 961 is a square number sorry this one is number 11 okay now let's move on to some number 12 so here in some number 12 amit walks 16 meter south from his house so here that one is amit house now 16 meter south so that one is 16 meter suppose and then turn east to walk 63 now from that place he turns 63 that one is 63 and that one is point c point c is the house of his friend while returning he walks diagonally from his friend house to reach back to his house so diagonally means here you have to count you have to join here ac so that one is diagonally okay and now you have to find out the length of ac okay that means what distance did he walk while returning so it's very easy because this one is here 90 degree that means right angle triangle so here you can apply pythagoras theorem that is ac square equal to ab square plus bc square that means here ac equal to root over 16 square then 63 square that one equal to root over 4225 and that one equal to 65 meter you have to find out the square root of 4225 that is 65 now sum number 13 that is the last sum so guys if you like my video please please share this video and please subscribe my channel so a ladder 6 meter long leaned against a wall 
suppose this one is the wall this one is the garden and this one is the ladder so here ac is the ladder ab is the wall and that is here 6 meter the ladder reaches the wall to a height of 4.8 so that one equal to 4 point height meter find the distance between the wall and the foot that means you have to find out the base here so again you can apply the pythagoras theorem so here bc square equal to hypotenuse square minus perpendicular square that means here 6 square minus 4.8 square so here bc equal to root over 36 and the next one here as here 4.8 so 4.8 that one equal to 23.04 okay so now if you subtract from 36 you will get here 12.96 now the square root of 12.96 that equal to 3.6 meter and that one is your answer